Welcome to yet another session of the I Am Public Speaking Masterclass. Today, we are going to talk about how to engage and connect with your audience whilst you are on stage. As a speaker, you need to appreciate the fact that you're communicating to your audience. If you cannot engage them, you will lose them. Good speakers are those who can engage with their audience. It's not about you having the confidence, but it's about you engaging with your audience. So number one is, how do you do that? You can ask questions. One, you can ask questions to your audience to engage with them. It could be rhetorical questions or it could be like direct questions where they give you feedback. Number two is you can share your personal story or experience. Something has happened to you and you just take that time to share with their audience. You see that they will be following if you know how to tell that story. You can also tell a joke. Once you tell a joke, you see that your audience will get in line and uh, you get to know how engaging they are. If they are laughing, yes, it simply means that they are following. But if you tell one joke and uh, they don't laugh, please, maybe you can uh, give the second one if, it's, if it is interesting. But then if I give the first joke and they are not laughing, they are just like, I will not give another joke again. But then you can tell a joke if you are good at that. Number four, get people to repeat information out loud. Sometimes when I see that my audience are tired or they are not engaging, I can tell them some keywords and they get to engage with me. So I politely ask them. So please, I just want you to repeat after me if you can. I am great. You say I am great. I am powerful. I'm number one. I will take action today. I believe in myself. I'm a billionaire. You see that they will be shout that I'm a billionaire part. And you're just preparing their minds to get them to interact with you, to engage, and to bring them to the audience or to the presentation. Bring them alive and give them that opportunity to interact with you. So you can say things and you will say that back. And a lot of speakers use that. So you just need to know the keywords that you are using. And once you say one, and the moment they are telling, re repeating that out, loud to you you figure out what to say next because it's not something that you've planned so i am powerful they say i am powerful i am great they say i'm great i am unique i'm a champion i'm a billionaire i believe in myself today i'm going to take action they repeat and once they repeat you see that it's going to, it's just lovely you can also tell your audience to sing a popular song that you know so in Ghana, I use the national anthem or national youth anthem. It goes, rise Ghana youth for your country. So once I start with that, you see that everybody knows that national youth anthem. So use a song that they know, use an anthem or whatever uh, phrase that they know and they can sing along or recite along. So apart from reading out loud, you can give them that tax or let someone lead that session. Then, number five is you can also take questions from your audience. The first one was you asking them questions. The second one is you taking questions from them. Tell them to ask you questions. In the moment they keep asking the questions, you get them engaged. You get them engaged. Number six is you can use images and videos during your presentation to engage your audience. Maybe they are sleeping, maybe they are tired, they are fatigued. You can use videos to what engage with them. So after the videos, they will discuss. Or you show them an image and ask them questions like, what can you see? What is the difference? Spot the difference. And uh, you see that they will be cracking their, their uh, minds to tell you the difference or to share with you their experiences. Then you can also uh, bring them on stage. Bring some people on stage to do one or two activities or maybe some to do some icebreakers. You can also use icebreakers to uh, bring people back to life, to engage them. So these are some of the uh, te techniques that you can use to get your audience engaged. But there are more, but you just, these are a few. Just figure out 
how you can bring your audience alive and do that and do that so thank you and i believe you're learning something hope to see you in the next presentation my name still remains Ibrahim Mustafa and i'm your friend i'm your friend and i want you to succeed <laughs>